Coletta Air in Oscoda lent a big hand to a Michigan museum last month. The company offered the Yankee Air Museum in Belleville the chance to repaint its B-25 bomber. With Coletta providing a hangar and covering the cost of paint, experts made quick work of the project. The plane flew in on December 20th, with work continuing past Christmas. Yankee Air President Kevin Walsh says the plane is an amazing piece of war history. The ones that survived came out very, very late in the war. <clears throat> Excuse me, came out late in the war, and they never saw combat. Um, so to actually have one that saw combat and survived scrapping uh, at the end of the war, <clears throat> really, really rare. The bomber has served for 77 straight years in various capacities and remains flight worthy to this day. Walsh also says the plane is part of feminist history, produced by the many women who joined the workforce during World War II. We're going to talk about the introduction of women in the industrial workplace and how that changed a culture, um, you know, for, for decades uh, going forward. Upon completion, this restoration will bring the plane back to its wartime glory for the first time in decades. With most of the work complete, the bomber is scheduled to take off for home in a few short days. Walsh says it will receive its nickname and nose art in a few months. It will then resume its regular tours and air show schedule.